what's going on guys uh, back at the shop again um, waiting on it to warm up a little bit here before I go work on a customer vehicle so I decided I'm gonna mess around with the Accord for a little bit and uh, well you can kind of see how dirty and scratched up and nasty this thing is so we're gonna start working on that a little bit try to get it back to something presentable I'll do a little time lapse on that and I mean there's not much I can do with the clear coat but I can make it look a little better at least for the time being eventually the car is going to get painted anyway but in the meantime if we can make it look a little better then it was worth it Just want to show you this real quick i mean that's a huge huge difference there's still still some scratches in there we can work them out in time but i mean that's definitely a huge huge improvement and this is actually like a really nice color for what it is i've always liked it personally uh when it's clean so yeah there you go so i backed it out in the daylight it's horrible to get a good picture of really what this thing is doing but I think that you see how faded everything is and no matter what you do it does not want to come off um, this is fresh after a car wash um, and uh, yeah it, it's horrible horrible to try to get a picture of this but I'm telling you it is a world difference and this isn't even the products I normally use. I'm hard-headed. I really like my Meguiar's. And this is Meguiar's. Uh, but not... It's just a rubbing compound and polishing compound. But it, it definitely made a huge difference. If I had my fine cut cleaner and the other stuff I normally use, this thing would... There wouldn't even be a scratch left in that. It would be gone. But, I mean, you can see reflection in the paint and you see nothing on this side so it, it's cleanliness i mean everybody looked at this car and thought oh man it's just an old work car piece of junk but there's really a lot of nice to the car yet it's you just gotta find it That's where I'm gonna stop for now um, I have some customer work to do and uh, realistically I didn't have uh, I, I don't have enough um, yeah towels to uh, get through the whole car today anyway I wasn't planning on doing that I just uh, wanted to warm up before I came outside to work on a rear differential in the cold so what I'm doing or for now I just backed it out um, probably do a little more before the day's over but I think I think you can tell the difference even on camera it's such a deep deep red I mean I, I like I said I'd rather enjoy this color there's gonna be a ton of stuff like this that it's just not gonna come out and look right but considering the car was completely filthy I mean this is after two runs through the car wash and it looked like this so uh, eventually we're going to order the lowering springs for it we are going to put the 17s off the old one on it and yeah that's uh that that's the plan i mean this rear bumper I, every every inch of it needs needs some attention need a new gas or need i want to uh, eliminate these moldings i can't stand them and as you can see they're kind of gimped up as they are so yeah uh 
that's where we're going to stop this one for now and i'll get back with you